all right folks and welcome to another video today i'm going to be showing you how to properly configure your wi-fi so that you get the best connection possible out of your wireless network now for the purpose of this video you're going to need a little app called wi-fi analyzer now it's definitely available for android i'm not sure about ios and you can get it free on the play store so once you've downloaded this app you're going to want to uh, go into the application and open it so you want to go ahead and click the eye icon and make sure it's set to channel graph now here on the graphs you'll be able to see a load of different curves some of the curves will overlap with each other and that's going to show interference ideally for your wireless connection or your ssid network name you're going to want to have a curve off on its own if you click towards the left of the graph uh, you can swap between 2.4 and the 5 gigahertz channels now ideally for both these you want your curves to be off on their own so there's no interference with me i live in a built up area so there's a lot of houses around me and this is especially important uh, for me in the house that i film primarily in because before we knew about this application we were actually getting interference and weren't getting the most out of our wi-fi obviously if you're using a wired connection this isn't going to be a problem but for the people that do wireless that maybe use the laptops and the smartphones and stuff you're not getting the most out of your connection so yeah if you take a look at the curves on the wi-fi analyzer app and you see they overlap quite a lot and you're actually getting some interference ideally you're going to want to change your wi-fi channel now in order to do this you're going to have to type in the ip address of your router or your gateway into your internet browser and then you should be looking at your router settings and from there in wireless settings you should have a option to change your wi-fi channel both for the 2.4 and 5 gigahertz channels if your router broadcasts at both them frequencies but yeah folks that's going to be the end of this little video on how to properly configure your wi-fi using wi-fi analyzer if you liked the video please throw a thumbs up on it if you really enjoyed the video please subscribe to my channel it helps me out an awful lot you can follow me anytime on twitter and facebook at for the banter and i but until next time my friends goodbye